This is delicious! Yes! Yes! Screw you guys! I'm going home! Hey folks, Crazy Climber 80 here again, and this time we're going to look at another request, and this is Top Players Golf for the Neo Geo MPS Arcade Cabinet, and uh, this was created by SNK in 1990. Uh, I originally had reviewed this, but I didn't like it so much the first time, when a Charlie Cat YouTube user came along and requested that I re-uploaded it, I tried it again, and yeah, it's actually a pretty good game. Um, uh, what is it called? Uh, Neo Turf Masters is actually a lot better than this, but this is still a pretty good game. Uh, you get to select from either, uh, what is it called? The Top Players Country Club or the SNK Championship Golf Course uh, courses. And you can choose to play Stroke Play, which is uh, 18 holes by yourself. You can use choose a, a match play, which is 18 holes versus the computer, and I guess on some cabinets, perhaps you can play against uh, the second player, but not in this one that I played. Uh, you can also play what's called Nassau game, which is a cool point system, and we'll look at that later. Uh, this this game has some really cool options. This allows you to look at the course and you can move the joystick around and look all over the place. And you could press A button, uh, button A, to uh, to call up certain uh, menus and you can also start up your your power swing. And button B, uh, button B can choose between different clubs or it can cancel out uh, selections and see the game kind of tells you how to use these controls. Buttons C and D are not used in this game. And uh, the meter has little indicators to the left of it and they show if you press the button in that part of the meter what the ball will do. And it can just go straight, it can hook to the left, it can go uh, further uh, if you uh, hit the beater just before the top and you can also slice it to the right and the beater can go up and it can go back down and when it goes back down <laughs> excuse me left side of fairway is safer because of river on right <laughs> try to keep ball I like right this caddy fairway for easier second shot to green um, if the ball if the meter is on its way down then you can uh, uh, Put some backspin on your ball, and we're going to select the uh, shot here. There is a wind meter, and you'll see it at the bottom center, where it says stroke. To the right of that, that is the amount of wind that you have, and that is just one right now. You have a limited amount of time to select each thing, and there you can uh, change your club by pressing A or B. <coughs> Excuse me. I have contracted COVID recently, so my voice is not quite where I, I would like it to be. Sorry. But uh, I am getting a lot better. I had a very, very bad sore throat the first day, and this is the second day, and I feel so much better. But I have to keep taking pills that were uh, prescribed. Um, if you play the match play against the computer. The computer is nigh unbeatable.
they make the most precise shots. And even if they screw up on the very next shot, they will have ridiculous right. luck. And you will see the uh, lie in that little uh, that little window there, and you will need to uh, shoot accordingly. And there, I got par. Even if you get par, even if you get below par, you will have to spend a credit to play another hole. See? There are bunkers on both sides of fairway, so <laughs> careful tee shot is needed on this hole. A <laughs> very goofy, uh, upbeat uh, voice of your caddy. <laughs> But the graphics are just lovely, and I love that you can look all over the course. That's helpful because uh, uh, you only have a, a part of the screen when you choose to uh, when you choose to uh, hit the ball. You know, start the uh, swing meter, or power meter, or whatever. <laughs> But yeah, you will get a default club uh, given to you by the computer as a suggestion as to what to, what might be the best one to use. Definitely do not always uh, rely on that. In fact, much, much of the time you are going to need to change it. Now you will see little white markers on the, uh, on the power meter or swing meter or whatever and those are our ideal uh, spots to stop the uh, marker on and uh, as I said there are little indicators you see the uh, arrow with the dotted line on it that just means just a straight shot uh, with not that much power and then there is the hook to the left on that meter and then after that there is just an upward arrow and that is a stronger nice one. Uh, a stronger swing that is straight Green slopes up and then to the right. above that is the uh, slice to the right there was an easy uh, par there <coughs> excuse me I uh, I am off of work obviously but uh, I will try to take a test Green is surrounded by bunkers on this to see if I still have COVID later on. Required. <coughs> Excuse me, and hopefully I can go back to work. Now, if you uh, you can accidentally uh, shoot too many strokes on one hole, and then the game will tell you give up, and you will automatically have to play the next hole. Uh, and spend a continue and your character will hang his head in shame <laughs> now that uh, Nassau game if you select it uh, you might be able to score or knock off an extra stroke from your game if, uh, if you can, like, get closer to the cup than your opponent, or uh, if you can have a longer first uh, drive than your opponent, or something like that. Just various ways that you can uh, in, in, uh, excuse me, improve your score. I am only going to play uh, four holes, and then we will at least see pictures of the remaining uh, holes in this course and then we will nice see all bar. the holes on the uh, other course which was the SNK Championship Golf Course and this is the Top Players Country Club. I do not remember seeing this in arcades back in the day. On this hole, fairway is in the middle of a pond. Watch out also for bunker left of the green. <laughs> Look at that thin, thin strip to the left of the uh, water. You don't want to. You don't want to go in that direction. You need to hit the ball onto the island. I like that little bridge to the right. 
This game has some very nice graphics. It is well, well worth checking out. Probably uh, deserves to be in your uh, Neo Geo library if you're uh, collecting the uh, carts for your MVS arcade cabinet. And I have one. It's uh, it's not in working order right now. One of these days, uh, when I feel better, nice one. <laughs> I will uh, work on seeing if I can get somebody to Green fix slope. my Neo Geo Uphill MVS. I do have a golf game, but it is the Superior Neo Turf Masters. For birdie. Yeah, don't hit very hard when you're on the green. Nice birdie. And like I said, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna get continue here, but we will see at least pictures of the remaining holes on this course. And you will see a scorecard like this. Even even if you play the game through, you will see a uh, scorecard like that. There will be a uh, an ending if you uh, uh, play against another player. Otherwise, you will just I think restart the whole course, but having to of course uh, put in another credit for each hole. Uh, that guy that said the title there uh, does the same work for uh, World Heroes, I think. Uh, but, yeah, we're going to just look at the remaining holes and the uh, advice from the caddies. <laughs> that might be the easiest course of all because it's just a straightaway. Uh there are the usual birdies, pars, eagles, bogeys, double bogeys. Um, and like I said, if you have too many strokes on one hole, then uh, the game will just say, give up. And you will have to go to the next hole and spend a continue. But this, uh, it, it might seem confusing at first as far as the controls and the uh, power meter, but uh, you'll get used to it pretty quick. And on the last hole, you can actually use the zoom function or the course function and look at the uh, clubhouse up there. Isn't that cool? <laughs> That's above the, uh, the whole uh, uh, the whole hole there on the 18th <laughs> and if you get a hole in one you get a little cheesecake uh, fan service <laughs> but that is the uh, I cheated to get that that's I've got a bunch of hole in ones but that's the uh, final scorecard of the game and then you start all the holes over again now we're gonna look at match play and this is me playing versus the computer and I get to select my computer opponent of those four guys you can choose And the computer is just immaculate. It's ridiculous. It's not not very fair. They they seem to have always the exact wow, the right amount started. of power. Put the ball on the green in two if you drive straight on this hole. Good birdie champ. And they never uh, if if they do falter, which is extremely rare, they get out of it quickly. Even when you have just the right amount of power to your shot, they always seem to get farther with theirs. It's ridiculous. And the computer character will have a red ball or an orange ball. And see where I hit it? And I have the, just the right perfect amount of power and placement. They put in the same placement, but somehow they they get to hit it further than I do. Now whichever player is further from the cup, they will get to go next. I'm using the uh, course function. This really is nice and I love the uh, how high above the course you apparently are. Your god watching down at the <laughs> golf course with these uh, clouds passing by below you some really really nice touches in this 
for a first first golf game for the uh, the Neo Geo. Ooh, just missed the bunker. Nice. Um, nice one. S and K did a ridiculous job. I mean, this looks much more polished than uh, Golden T Golf. You know, which which got more uh, more notice for sure. And of course, they get closer than I did. Nice one. Green slope, straight uphill. Yeah, and the uh, caddy will often give you advice even on the green, not just the uh, course itself. Putt for birdie. <laughs> Green slope, straight uphill. Putt for birdie. And again, look for the uh, look for the direction on the lie nice on birdie. the green to know whether you need to uh, hit it to the left, to the right, uh, give it a little bit more juice. <laughs> and we're going to look at a little bit of uh, the Nassau game. And again, the Nassau game gives you uh, opportunities to maybe uh, lower your score. And we're also going to look at the SNK Championship Golf Course. And with that course, uh, you playing. can choose out or in. Or, or actually, uh, I think you can choose that for either course that you play in uh, uh, Nassau game. But with Nassau game, you can choose out or in, and that means uh, either the uh, back nine or the front nine. You only play nine holes instead of uh, all 18. I don't, I don't really know my golf terminology all that well. I just learned some of these things uh, recently. There is also something, I guess, that is called... Uh, dormy hole. Sometimes a uh, hole will say dormy hole, and that is actually when a player or a, a team in golf has a stroke lead the same number as the holes remaining. And that's just called dormy hole. I am not entirely sure about the history of that, but that's basically what it means. But yeah, uh, you see the plus sign. You can just move that left or right to uh, change, slightly change the direction of your shot. Nice one. Green slope, straight uphill. The uh, uh, power or direction forgiveness factor is uh, not very. Uh, not very friendly in this game. <laughs> it's much more uh, friendly in uh, uh, Neo Turf Masters. Nice birdie. Well, I hope Green you uh, enjoy your Great weekend, folks. Hope you are COVID-free, unlike some of us. <laughs> but I should, I should nice be getting birdie. over this pretty quick. I don't have a sore throat anymore. Um, when I did. I had a little, a little tickle in my Adam's apple every so often, a little tiny con contraction that kind of hurt, and it kept me from getting any this sleep is a hole hardly. Where the fairway is split into two. The left fairway seems safer. Which See, I chose uh, the other option. I think I chose in, and then that's the uh, back, the back nine, or the uh, uh, frick, I can't remember. Uh, You'll, you'll play one set of holes or the other set of holes when you choose in or out. And there is a uh, is toward the green near in pin the prize. Aim for the green directly. So uh, whoever gets closer to the pin with their their shot between me or the computer, or in uh, some cabinets that will allow you to play uh, one player versus two player, whoever gets closer gets, I think, a point shaved off their score or a, uh, a stroke shaved off their score. 
which is pretty cool. Sploosh. <laughs> We're gonna just shoot it again real quick here. I just wanted to show you uh, uh, bits of the uh, uh, of the Nassau uh, play. Yeah, this is really, really a, a very well put together game of golf for the early uh, existence of the Neo Geo MVS. A lot of a lot of games for the Neo Geo had a, a lot of polish, and the graphics were just like nothing you had seen just about at that point. The, the Neo Geo was super popular. And it debuted in 1990. The Neo Geo was mostly known for uh, um, fighting games, but there were plenty of other things to like, like this and Neo Turf right Masters on. and uh, some good shoot 'em ups. There was a uh, Pole Star. Uh, Blazing Star that were very, very good. Nice birdie. Uh, some of my favorite games for the Neo Geo were, were fighting games. Real about Fatal Fury Special, uh, Fatal Fury Special, uh, Waku Waku 7. Uh, but uh, Neo, Neo Turf Masters I really, really, really liked too. This hole has a winding fairway. But yeah, you will always need to uh, spend and continue to play another uh, another uh, hole. And now we're going to look at all the holes on the uh, SNK Championship Golf Course. But uh, yeah, some of the some of the courses are very very treacherous. There are a few that are actually quite easy, and if you've gotten used to the controls and used to the uh, uh, swing meter or whatever you want to call it, then uh, you can uh, you can definitely get better than par on those. But that is top players golf, and again, this was one of the er this was one of the earliest titles. In fact, I think I read that it was like the third title released for the uh, SNK Neo Geo MVS cabinets. I did not notice the uh, Neo Geo until uh, probably like the following year, and then I I, I think the first game I saw was. Uh, uh, Fatal Fury and it appeared at the uh, department store where I worked at yeah there's Dormy Hole like I said that's when a, a player or team has a stroke lead the same the same numbers as holes remaining and uh, when you do beat the game with uh, uh, match play you get this type of uh, ending. Your player uh, walks walks out to an adoring crowd, and there, then his name appears, and it says, "You are the top golf player!" Hooray! <laughs> well, that was uh, Top Players Golf, created by SNK in 1990 for the Neo Geo Arcade Cabinet. Well, this is Crazy Clamberini. Say thanks for watching Top Players Golf. I hope to see you someday soon, and with me recovered for my next video. Y'all have a good one, everybody. Bye-bye.